lovelies, we are going to be doing a everyday makeup routine. So here's the tea, is that I went to film this and then both my camera batteries were dead. And then I ended up doing a YouTube live and I made a salad. And if you saw that, this would probably be like a week ago. Wait, what's today? Monday. This will probably be, it was on Monday. I'm going to post this on Wednesday. So it's probably on Monday that if you saw it, I did a YouTube live. There was a couple of cuties on there. We were just like chatting. Not too many people, but like it was nice to kind of have some people show up. But anyways, I said that I was going to film this today. So I'm going to stick to it because I told people. So now I have to. But anyways, um, I'm back. Battery is charged mostly. I'm ready to get started for real Z's this time. Bangs are up in this little situation. I like it because it keeps my bangs on my face. So that's always essential. So if you have like a headband or something, it's always good to have. First thing, you always need to put on sunscreen. Like you can help it please put on something it's definitely helpful i have two that i like to kind of like cycle through i have this skin cuticles it's ff50 and it uv defense sunscreen so when the lady sold me on this one she was like it doesn't like go like the sun doesn't go into your skin it just like bounces off so it's like different than like regular sunscreen so like i wouldn't be getting like any sun damage at all but like this one or like some other ones you could get sun damage still like to your skin but like not sunburnt i don't know the other one i use is the super goop glow screen this one's 40 percent or for fps 40 i feel like i kind of want to use the skin cuticles one just because it's got a nice tint to it they both are like tinted but i just like the way that this one kind of works i guess i usually just do like a little like i just kind of like drag it um around my nose because that is my problem oh my gosh i should be careful because i'm wearing a white shirt um but anyways that's kind of like my problem area just kind of rub it mostly on my cheeks and my nose because that is where i get sunburned the most so we're just rubbing that in okie dokie so sometimes it kind of just depends on like what's happening in my day but if I feel like I want to do like a foundation, like more coverage, I'll do a Bare Minerals Bare Pro or a Bare, like I'll do a Bare Minerals Bare Pro. I have two different shades that I kind of play with because I lost the one that I liked and then I was like, I really like this foundation, like I'm going to get it again. So I have that. I really want to try some liquid foundations at some point, but I like the powder ones because I feel like it goes on pretty seamlessly. And like when I went back the second time to like go get it again, I could not remember what shade I was. And like this one I hit pan on. But anyways. Um, I don't really want to do that today. But I do really like the Bare Minerals ones. Um, I have been using. Okay so hold on guys. I'm going to do just a little bit of concealer. Just to kind of conceal some spots. I have been using the Tarte Creases Concealer. For like literally ever. And I just have never gotten like. I've never really felt like switching. Um, and because, like, I saw so much in this, I feel like switching just doesn't feel like a priority. But I would like to try other ones and, like, see what kind of works best for me. And I also feel like, honestly, like, everybody's skin is a little different. Um, in terms of, like, what goes on the way you want. You know, if that makes sense. Um... So yeah, I don't know. But I always feel like sometimes if you don't want to do a foundation, a little concealer can really go a long way. So I'll be right back. I'm going to go wet this beauty blender. Going to just blend this out. I don't know. So that's kind of how I feel about concealer. Like I feel like it really does a lot for me personally. And I don't really do foundation too often. I also am breaking out really bad lately. Which I feel like is mostly hormonal. And... It's like stress related but that's why i usually don't do too much but also like today i'm kind of doing a lot sometimes i don't even do concealer but today i kind of just like felt like geek because i like it but i guess but i heard also heard that bare minerals is also really good for acne like it doesn't help make you break out like it's nice for that 
but honestly, I don't know. The concealer works pretty well. I mean, I don't, I don't know. I don't know where I'm going with that. Anyways, I really honestly don't do a lot when it comes to like everyday makeup. I feel like it's usually pretty neutral. So lately, I've been using like the same two options, but I know that I said I was doing like everyday makeup and like what I usually do, but I kind of want to mix it up today, so let me know. But I usually use, I'm going to like just tell you what I usually use and then maybe we'll mix it up a little bit. But I usually use Pixi on the Glow blush. I really like this one. It's a little bit of a lighter shade. Um, I don't know if it says the shade anymore. Anywhere. Um, I don't know. But it's kind of like a lighter pinky one. And then when I want to go darker, I tend to use the REM Beauty. Like, it's kind of a hot mess. But Audition Lip and Cheek stick i've never used this on my lip i would honestly should try it because i think it'd be interesting but i have like a lot of not a lot but i have a couple of like good options when it comes to like my blush i have the kaija if that's how you say it um but in shade three in shade bossy and it's the like stamp and i have not used it in a while so i kind of want to use that today um because I feel like this one I like about this is that it feels like it's not going to be too much. Like it's always, it's not like overdoing it. I've had that for a while though. So I feel like it's definitely on the, on the running out. Um, I also feel like sometimes it's just not enough. So maybe we will add a little bit of the on the glow. I feel like you can't really see it a lot in um the camera but that looks nice okay and then i don't know why but it's become such a habit of mine is i love the dandelion by tart no it's not by tart might be it's by benefit um but i always i just love that and i feel like whenever i use a cream blush i kind of just tend to like brush it over with this one let it kind of like set i guess I don't know. I just always have been doing that, and I feel like it's just a habit, I guess. Um, highlight. I think I'm going to honestly just use the same one I usually use, and just use the REM. REM and shade Miss Mercury. I use it so often, it's a problem. But I do have, like, Fenty Beauty. I have Milk, and that's kind of really all I have. Like, I really want to branch out more. I have, like, a... Something. I feel like I want to branch out more um, and do try other like things. Um, I might add some to like maybe my birthday wish list, so keep a lookout for that video. But I don't know. I just feel like I have like not a lot, which is weird because I feel like I used to have a lot, but I got rid of so much like stuff that was like, expired. I was like, I don't need this. Okay. Anyways, now that I've done that, that is like literally majority of what I do. I don't usually put on any eyeshadow because I just don't feel like it's necessary. My lashes, however, need to happen. I need to do something. I kind of feel like maybe messing with my eyebrows a little bit. I don't know if they, I doubt, I hope they don't need to be tweezed. Uh, something I like want and I'm going to talk about it now and then I'm going to talk about it later in that video. But I'm go I really want like... Um, an eyebrow waxer for my house. No, that's fine. Let's do my lashes, guys. I've had this be this one for like ever. Um, I don't know. I just like. I don't know where I'm going with that. I just. I don't know. I think about. Like, I've been watching a lot of YouTube lately. And, like, as I should, because if I'm going to be a YouTuber, like, I should be up in the YouTube vibes, like, watching and stuff. Okay, sorry. The la the I'm going to be using the Lash Paradise. It's, like, the better than sex dupe. I would, I really like to, like, want to, like, invest in, whoa. I would really like to, like, invest in, like, good makeup and good clothing and things like that. And I miss, like, having a good mascara. But I got this when I, like, was in school. And I couldn't afford to, like, buy anything else. And I honestly... Okay. I honestly still can't. 
really afford to buy anything else. Um, but maybe for Christmas or something, if someone feels really inclined, they can give me a Sephora gift card. And I can go and get like a nicer one. I feel like that really did a lot. I have not put on mascara in a very long time, to be honest, because I'm so lazy about my makeup a lot of the time. And like that kind of just is me kind of saying like, you do not have to put on makeup every day. Like I don't, I really don't. And that's just true. And I'm doing this because I want you to like, just kind of show you guys that like, yes, I can do everyday makeup sometimes, but I also don't. And I never really go above and beyond anyways. So like really, what was the point? I don't know. But we can just chat for like a second. So basically what's been up with me, you guys are probably wondering like what's up with Tylee, like what is she doing? Um, I've been implementing new routines. I'm proud of myself for it. And like today I journaled, I reflected. Um, I don't know. I'm not really sure. I kind of just, and I filmed this video for you guys. Um, anyway, in terms of my hair, I washed my hair today. I let it air dry because I was not really in the mood to deal with it. But sometimes I'll use like my round brush thingy that I got from my boyfriend's mom. But I'm pretty sure it's just like from Amazon. Um, but it feels super soft and I love it. But anyway, my, my bangs needed help. So that's why it's up in the roller. And that's kind of what's up with that. But... I don't know. I'm kind of just talking nonsense right now. I have a lot of videos planned for you guys. We're going to cut this video off because there's not really anything else you guys need to know. But I'm... I'm in a... I got... Okay. What? I've got a lot of video ideas for you guys. They're going to be really good. I'm going to be filming a week in the life this week. Of... Um... I think. We'll see how well that goes because to be honest, I hate vlogging in front of people. And I was gonna film a video this week where I just do like a week in the life of a dancer because I've been, I'm gonna be performing this weekend and I'm in rehearsals every Monday for a show that I'm in. And I was like, it'd be fun to like kind of vlog it a little bit and just kind of like show you guys about my process. So we'll see. I'll start the video and then if I don't end up even vlogging anything that's worth it today, then I'll just call it quits. Probably. So. Anyways, I hope you guys like this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I got so many like big videos planned. I just kind of like wanted to do this little sit down with you. Show you guys what I do my makeup wise. Should we take my thing out? Ooh, 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 ooh. The way that does so much for me. I gotta do this like every morning. Oh, that does so much. Anyways, I literally don't know what's going on right now, but I hope you guys like seeing my everyday makeup look. It's like so simple. Um, I hope you guys like it. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.